So here you're, you're seeing sample build.xml file. As I previously mentioned, it has several elements like project, target, tasks, etc. Every build.xml file, it has to have its root element which is project and target. Target can have multiple tasks as we already discussed and the targets could depend on other targets as well. So as you can see here in the sample file, the project has attributes name and default. You can have another attribute called base, base directory as well. We'll be seeing when we are building our sample build.xml file very soon. And also the attribute default which you see, it is the default target for the build script. A project may contain any number of targets, but this default attribute, it specifies which target should be considered as the default. And it is mandatory for, a, for the build.xml file. And next, you can see the name and also the base directory. The base directory is nothing but it is the root folder for the project. So let's go ahead and create a sample build.xml file. 